Oh, Westen, super, danke. Westen. I am Wally Lowry from Santa Rosa, California, USA. What's your job? I'm a retired professor, university. We are coming from, uh, from Switzerland and we are here in South Lebanon uh, and we are waiting for Ahmadinejad. He is a Stanford graduate in economy, he's a graduate in, uh, has a master's degree in business administration from the University of California in Berkeley, some of the most eminent universities in California and he has uh, gathered a lot of experience in many years many I'm years old. of economy <laughs> and business he had seen many presidents he i just happy to have my help that's the important part and i'm his personal physician he's my personal physician not only his interpreter <laughs> and guide in lebanon he keeps me going i'm his son-in-law i love it Another thing happening now is the coming of the president of Iran, Ahmadinejad, yeah. and he's going to arrive this evening. There's pictures all over the place. The Lebanon. And the question coming here is that how uh, do you view their uh, uh, position here? Do you think this is an interference in the internal politics of Lebanon, or this is a fair game to support the resistance? I think they need to listen to everybody, and uh, they should listen to him. So I think it's fair. It's a fair game yeah. for him to come here. Yeah. We are here in Marun Ras, which is a village of resistance against the Israeli occupiers who came up to this hill and tried to keep it as a strategic landing. The same reason they took over the Golan Heights on the other side to protect this occupied Galilea land. And a lot of people were killed and some of the martyrs you see them on the wall. You see, if you come here and you say, I have been massacred abroad, I have been killed and yeah, I need I know, a yeah. land. You can come and say, you know, please, can we live with you and have a land? You don't come here and say, oh, I have all the money on earth and I have all the support from the power back in the West, and you try to impose yourself. See, it then they have resistance. Then you will encounter resistance. Oh, absolutely. And 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 Hezbollah, we're finding today, is a resistance movement. 
is not the image that is projected in the United States of terrorists or uh, some bandits from the street. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah. I agree with you, Wally, that it is a fair game for Ahmadinejad to come here as a counter to what the other side is mm -hmm. doing by having full game with the West. Yeah. Without the support of the West, these gated communities south of our border will not survive. I am Christian Lebanese, and uh -huh. there are a lot of Christian Lebanese who are opposed to him coming here, because they view that as an interference in the internal affairs of the country, oh. you see, and uh, other Christians and uh, other Muslims in this country view their co his coming as a support to the resistance mm -hmm. movement of the Hezbollah. As you see, a lot of young people were killed on this strategic hill. I think it's strategic hill for the Israelis for some reason, and probably understand that because of your background. But what is it? Is, so you think it's a fair game for, for, a, for a foreign president to yeah. come and visit a resistance movement right. here? I think the more visiting that goes on throughout the world, the better we are for peace. Huh.